Hello everyone, how are you all? I am Mo and you are welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing good. Today, last time I am filming here because we are moving from Mumbai. That's why I will not be able to put full length videos for some time. So I will try to be in touch through short contents but I cannot give you any words. You know how things are going on, shifting, too much work, finding new addresses, getting settled down. I hope you will be with me during this time. Now, without further ado, let's get into the video because I want to share a few products that are new on my channel, but I have been with them quite a long time and that's why I can actually share my thoughts about them. So, let's go. And I would like to start with a requested one, Dr. Toner from Round Lab. It is very famous here in India and I can understand why. Country with extremely hot and humid weather, but I don't know why it is that much famous in Korea because everything about this product is very basic and not that catchy. Almost watery toner with a touch of viscosity, not even touch, touch of viscosity, you understand, right? Something that is enjoyable during summertime or people with oily to very oily skin, People who don't like viscous toner, don't like the feeling that viscous toner left behind or if you haven't used toner at all but you want to try toner to incorporate into your skincare routine, this toner is for you. Very simple and very basic. A toner that looks like a hydrating one, a viscous one when you put it in your hands but when you use on your face, your skin just eats that viscosity and it turns into a simple watery refreshing toner. I can recommend this one to beginner but I will not buy it for myself I mean, I will not repurchase it because it feels boring to me. Texture, consistency, viscosity, effect, result, everything is very basic, very boring. In the ocean of beautiful K-Beauty toners, it gets disappeared. It is sitting on the top of my shelf, I'm watching it but it doesn't allure me to use it again and again. It's good but it's basic and very boring basically. Next I have this chamomile gel toner from Hygie or Higgy. This is my second purchase from this brand after I was blown away by their ginseng serum. I talked about this serum in this video, kindly check it. It was my discovery. It's an amazing affordable alternative to I am from ginseng serum. Now this toner is very interesting. Look at the texture. Seems like ideal for normal to dry skin, right? No. Oily skin, one pump. One and a half pump, combination skin. Two pumps, normal skin. Two and a half pumps for dry skin. Adding pumps means adding hydration. For oily skin, you don't need more than one pump because one pump will add hydration and after absorption, it kind of mattifies your skin. I saw it, that's why I'm telling it. I was very shocked because it feels very soothing, not only soothing because it has chamomile extract but it feels very very cooling. I was very shocked when I used it. Does it contain any alcohol because it feels that much cooling. Then I realized no it has deep sea water from where the cooling sensation is coming on. I also use it as a wash off mask. This is the video where I demonstrated how I use it and how I compile it. It just turns down my skin's heat. Hyaluronic acid toner from Isentry, not the hyaluronic acid plus. I gave away all my empties to Bangarwala. I had the 400 ml and I completely finished it within three months because I literally drenched myself into that toner. I used it on my body, I used it on my face, I used it as a uh, spot sheet mask. I also mix it with my hand cream for nighttime treatment. This is a very lightweight, beginner friendly, viscous, hyaluronic acid based toner with simple formulation and a silky finish. It absorbs nicely and it leaves that silky finish that can be used as a toner come serum in a single step. I prefer to layer it three to four times. It is that much lightweight. And that's the main reason why I finished it very quickly. It's a very basic and no-nonsense hyaluronic acid based toner. When I want nothing complicated, a simple basic hydrating routine, just two products, a toner and a moisturizer or a toner and a sunscreen, I reach for it. This one is so simple, yes, so thirst quenching and our last product, AHA Apple Toner Cleansing Pad from Goodall. This is an exfoliating product for everyday use. 
I can use it every day, although I don't have that much uh, tolerance power. If you have normal tolerance power, you can use it multiple times in a day. This is not for your one night treatment. This is more for regular everyday treatment. Like, you know, everyday cleaning, exactly like this. It's not a product with high strength. And I actually like this kind of product. I will dominate the product. I will rule the product. The product should not rule me or my skin. It's watery, refreshing, hydrating, and it's good. But next time, I will get the toner and not the pad. Why? Here comes the most controversial topic. Do you actually need toner pads in your routine? Do you need to buy toner pads? No, but you can if you want. For the sake of review, I will buy them, but I don't need them. And you don't need them either. As a friend, not as a YouTuber, as a friend, I can tell you, you don't need them. They are same product with less quantity and bigger price. Get the toner and separate cotton pad and use them whatever you wish. You want to exfoliate, do it with cotton pads. You want hydration, do it with your hands. But I must say, these toner pads are very tempting. The moment you have them, your hand will go towards them only because they are very convenient to use and they give little bit of mental satisfaction. You know, swiping face, cleaning face. satisfaction But do you actually need them? Few years before, influencers, brands, they used to tell you to not waste your toners by putting them into cotton pad, use them with your hands just to avoid product wastage. And now these brands and influencers are promoting cotton pads, toner pads. Why? And in fact, those toner pads are not good for our environment. So it's your choice. It's your money. It's your wish. It's your skin. And that's all with my today's video. It's quite short, I know, because today we are out and I am sitting in the video of Banthan. <laughs> See you soon in my next video. Till then, take care, bye and stick around with me.